Okay, so Apple Vision Pro came out and this is already making waves in the internet. And I personally think this is going to change architecture practice forever, especially in the areas regarding productivity, construction, and actual experience. And I personally think that last experience part could provide a whole new business model for architects and designers of the future. Why now? Like VR headsets have been around for like five, six years. It's really no new news, right? Okay, so the number one thing is that this is Apple doing it. And Apple has been setting the standards for so many different things. Smartphone, wireless earbuds, and maybe this is the next big thing. And the second thing is that the resolution on this device is so much better. It takes you to like almost real life. And this is going to be very important when you're overlaying digital objects in 3D space. All this best technology can give you is coming with a huge price tag. So right now, it's really not for consumer level, I feel like, really for the first adopters. Maybe the price will go down or maybe it'll become an essential like our smartphone. But the number one thing is productivity. Having better productivity could actually cut down on the work time and bring back more work-life balance. So let's talk about that. Now, most obvious benefit that this AR goggle gives you is the fact that it gives you almost infinite screen real estate. This means that you're no longer limited by your computer, TV screens or phone screens for productivity. And this comes with like a very interesting use cases. For example, not only can you look at your models and renderings in like a super immersive screen, but also you can have many different tabs open and there's no more switching through different windows to find the exact conversation that you're looking for. So this is small little change is probably going to add up to many hours saved over time. Now, this is a minor optimization, but there's a huge thing that can come. Model making takes up so much time and effort. Now, what this offers you is the ability to project the 3D models onto a 3D space. And this is basically gives you the benefit of a 3D model. You get a lot more intuitive sense of space and scale as opposed to looking at it on a 2D screen. Now, whenever there's an iteration of feedback, instead of having to go back to the drawing board, what you can do is make changes in real time now. It's gonna be a huge time saver and it can actually make your designs better as well. Next thing I think is gonna be revolutionary for construction phase. When we, the ability to access the super high res 3D environment means that you're no longer bound by your physical location. And I think this is gonna change site visit forever. Now, instead of having to, you know, get into your car and travel all the way to wherever your project is, you're now able to have someone go to the site and just put up like a 360 camera. And all you have to do is just turn your head around to focus on specific detail. And you can ask that person to bring the camera around to specific location and you could have a discussion right then and there. And the second thing is that now you can actually work on a site that is like way across the globe. You will be able to attract clients and have projects from all over the world. And I think that is a huge boost to productivity. Now, sort of coming back to the collaboration aspect, I think this has a huge potential because projecting a 3D model into a real life space, there's really no limit to physical dimensions anymore. When you're talking to a client or showcasing your design to other people, you can simply get them to walk around the space in one-to-one -one scale. You can just like project it right onto the surface and then examine all the things that's important to you. You can also transmit this spatial experience to people who are not even in the country. So this can be a huge boost in terms of communicating with non-professionals who may or may not have an intuitive understanding of plan and have a much better understanding of what to expect when things are actually built. Now, let's think about taking this a step further. What if someone's able to subscribe to your design service and you will give them like a monthly or yearly update to their house? If someone is like wearing the goggle around the house all the time, you can actually customize their home and give them real time updates. Now, this gives us a whole new possibility where you can give your architectural design as a service. And in short, we can call this ASS. That doesn't sound too nice, but that's what the acronym says architecture as a service. Now, this finally gives architects access to a subscription model and it'll give you a stable income. You'll be able to continuously build up your following and your clientele and you will have virtually no limit as to your distribution. Now, we might have gone a little bit far there, but I think it doesn't hurt to do a bit of imagination and think creatively about what's potentially possible because who knows, this could really be a reality. And for now, what could actually change is maybe you no longer have to draw monitors in the office plan. So something to keep in mind. Let me know what you think in the comments and thanks for tuning in again and I'll see you guys next time.